Hi again, good morning. My name is Yaniv. We will continue today with this lab. We, in the last uh, session, we saw how to install R7730 with the policy and application control and HTTPS inspection. Now we're going to show how to upgrade to R8030. We can do it in two ways. I like the hard way, the, the difficult way, but it works better. Uh, the first way is uh, to download some TGZ file from Checkpoint Support and uh, to upgrade the firewall or firewall management. It's keep all the files in the file system and it's upgrade R7730 and make it R8030. Uh, the second way is to copy the Klish commands to save them in some notepad, to, to migrate export the database of the management, to install new R8030, to paste the Klish command and eventually to import the migrate that we export before. This way we can have a new fresh installed R8030 with new file system and to import all the configuration, all the database we don't need to to create the object from the beginning, all the firewalls, all the rules. This lab is very small and tiny. We can configure it from fresh in a few minutes, but imagine you have lots of objects, lots of rules, lots of not. It's very hard to understand how to do it from the beginning. Usually it's take how it it's take years to configure the policy and it's every time you add more and more things to the policy and now you need to to see what's going on and to make it from from fresh that's why it's very understand to migrate and to install fresh okay so we have the r7730 it looks like this. This is the policy. We have the application control. We have not. Again, imagine you have lots of uh, rules. We are going to export it, export it install new R8030, paste the, co the Klish commands, and migrate import. So we are going to start. I will download the migration tool for R8030. It's written here. Secure platform above R7540. We have R77, so this file is uh, for our uh, migrate. I will download it. I think I already did. I already downloaded it. I will import it to the management. I'm copy the file to the firewall and management server. I need to go the backup. Okay, here is the second way we can we can download the TGZ and do upgrade. I will use the second way. I will import the yeah this is the migration tools 
This way we can see also how to install fresh new R8030 and then to import. That's it from the web. I will connect. Okay. I'm going to the folder where I import the file. I will make it some directory. I will move the file. Okay, tau z xbf. I will extract the file and now I will run the migrate export. I will call it mig to r eighty thirty dot tgz. I know that uh, all the smart dashboard should be stopped, but to check it, I will do no active connected client, you see, it's empty, so I will run the migrate. We have two and a half minutes for the migrate, so let's hope it will work, it will finish. I will just pause till it will finish. Okay, the migrate succeed, the operation complete successfully. Now I will take First of all, we need to take the Klish command. We copy it. And we will take Well, we will move it. We need to take the file. Varlog CP backup backup. We will do CP to the backup folder. This way we can take it from here. We will see it as a file. It's uh, this way. I don't need to use the winner CP. You see, migrate, export. So right now, I have all the cliche commands. I have the migrate file. The next step is to install new R8030 all in one gateway with management to paste the cliche commands and then to migrate import the exported file. See you next.